Hey, oh my god, I broke my fucking leg coming down that pipe. Be careful. Sorry to hear that. Well, well, <laughs> look what we got here. Fresh meat. Hey there, fresh meat. Welcome to the slums, fresh meat. <laughs> High on Life looks to be jam-packed with absurdist comedy and big science fiction ideas molded around what appears to be a first-person shooter framework with elements of Metroid Venus. As fans just got heartbroken as this game is coming to Xbox and PC later this year. Got some delay. And today we'll talk more about this upcoming crazy game. Before we start, if you're new, make sure you are still the channel for more. High on Life is an upcoming comedic biopunk first-person shooter game which brings one of the biggest surprises at the year's Xbox Bethesda Game Showcase 2022 was the reveal of the brand new FPS from Squatch Gamers and more famously from the co-creator of Rick and Morty and also the Justin Roiland. Just like the studio's previous game, Trevor Saves the Universe, High on Life will feature the iconic voice talents of the Roiland himself and that uh, same unique band of humor. This game is going to be on another level. High on Life takes place in an absurd science fiction universe where humanity has been captured by an alien cartel and used as drugs of aliens. Interesting. Along the way, you will visit a variety of locations like a jungle paradise or a massive city built inside an asteroid. As the alien cartel invades the earth because they literally like to get high on humans and the game actually name itself High on Life. My, I mean this is pretty much relatable. Where you become a bounty hunter and set out to stop them. To accomplish this heroic feat, you need to team up with two talking guns who will like to comment on nearly everything you do in the game. This is very much interesting and also the level of game idea is on another level. High on Life is going to be a wild ride. The game itself is not afraid of breaking general conversions or even the fourth wall. With a particular section of our talking, Gatling and Gun talking about losing the game's E for everybody rating after killing an annoying alien kid getting a good chuckle out of us. But I'm pretty sure that this game is not actually rated for everyone. I mean, this is not supposed to be for everyone. Well, as I am live, is currently scheduled to launch on December 12, 2022, and this might be get another delay i think so and uh, just to make uh, you prepare for the game like uh, her you actually need a pretty good modern pc in order to play high on life at the, its best like as the pc specs are pretty demanding in order to get around 60 fps performance on high graphic settings at 1080p resolution you will need a sixth core i5 or ryzen 5 to 600 processor and coupled with either an RTX 2060 or RX 5600 XT graphics card as this actually requires a very high-end PC to run the high on life also the minimum 8 GB of RAM this is much needed for your safety purpose not getting hanged in the game and this is actually a pretty good and a decent PC to play games and yeah, be ready for this amazing game and if you're new, make sure to stay with the channel for more and also what you are thinking about this game, let me know in the comment section also. And see you all soon with another interesting video. Till then, have fun, good luck and peace.